Hey guys, Simcolor here and today we are going to start a new series which will be on Instagram and we'll try to make an Instagram clone uh, during the next lessons. Before I start, I just want to say that I did a rebrand on this uh, YouTube channel. So uh, as you can see, the logo is different, the thumbnails are different, the banner is different, everything is different. And this was made possible by Lara Fala Design, which I strongly recommend you follow her. Uh, this isn't a sponsorship, I paid for the work. So I just believe that the work was really well made. So if you guys ever need a logo, please go check it out. Okay, so onto the clone. So in this clone, we'll be using React Native. Uh, this is pretty similar to basic React, but it is made so that you can, with the same code, build for Android and iOS. And this is really cool because you only need one code base in order to upload to the iOS store and the Google Play store. So it simplifies the process a bunch and makes everything really straightforward. So in order to follow up with this this project, you don't really need to know a lot about programming. I'm going to try to explain everything and make everything as simple as possible. And you only need to know a bit about JavaScript and HTML, but I'll try to make everything as clear as, and as simple as possible for you guys. In this project, we'll be using Expo uh, in order to make the project as simple as possible to set up. We are going to be using Redux in order to store the current user data and we'll be using Firebase in order to uh, store images and to use the Firestore which is the database provided by Firebase. You have two options, real-time database or Firestore. Uh, Firestore is a bit better when you want to make queries that are heavier. Uh, it is a bit more complicated but it will pay out in the end. So regarding what this project will contain, uh, well, it will contain the basic features of Instagram. So you'll be able to post images, you'll be able to see the feed, you'll be able to search for users, you'll be able to see your profile and some more other features. Uh, again, as with any other project, I'm going to launch a redesign at the end and this redesign will contain uh, a design that's pretty much similar to Instagram. Because remember, in these projects that we do on YouTube, I only focus on the backend, or I primarily focus on the backend and the logic of the project. So the UI is something that's left a bit undone, uh, and the redesign will contain uh, the design that looks pretty much similar to Instagram, along with some other features that are really nice to have. Uh, but I'm yet to decide what those features will be. Be sure to stick around for that because it will for sure be a really cool project for you to download. Regarding the project, that's it. I'm sure you guys will love this project. It is really simple and there is a really cool project for you guys to start uh, learning React Native, Firebase and all of that. Uh, uploading of images, uploading to the database, saving to the database better yet, uh, reading from the database and all of that. And some simple simple queries that you guys will learn throughout this project. I suspect it will only take like 10 lessons in order to get this up and running. So yeah, it is uh, pretty straightforward. And if you guys have any questions about anything, then please use the forum at simcoder.com and I'll be sure to answer uh, any questions that you might have as fast as possible. Uh, remember, it is just me working on this channel, so it may take some time, but I always try to answer uh, at least within uh, a few days. You can also contact me at, uh, at simcoder.com. You have a page dedicated for that, and I'll answer you guys uh, without any problem. So yeah, that's it for uh, today. Uh, let's start this project and let's make something really cool and learn something really, really cool. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you again tomorrow and ciao.